there's been so much change here for the team itself and then campus itself too. Uh, for the first time, we are in one location where, okay, our locker room is next to the place where we practice, is next to the place where we're going to lift, is next to the place where we're going to go to a training room, is next to the place where we're going to eat and sleep. There's a team that's a lot more unified. There's a group of guys that understand the common mission and uh, our attention is high, our morale is high. We've increased our depth, we've increased our competition, we've increased our, uh, our competitive areas, uh, we've increased our strength, uh, and we've increased our maturity, our football IQ, tons of different areas. We always talk about it like filling a bucket. And if you fill it with all these different qualities, eventually it overflows for what the results are wanted to be. I've seen guys work. You know, they, they're working at it. They came in with an understanding uh, to a man that, uh, you know, we're here for a purpose. And I see a lot of guys that really embrace football. And when they have that spirit involved with practice and things that are grind and hard and hot weather and weights and, and all that long days, long meetings, and the guys will embrace it and come back for more every day, that's a really good sign for your team. That's a neat deal. People have invested in the football team and they've given them an opportunity to look good, feel good, and then play good. You know, there, there's been effort put into it and, uh, and, and they're well thought of and they're important. And when there's a sense of worth about you and, and anybody feels good about you, anybody invests in you, boy, doesn't that give you a sense of pride and ownership that you can increase? And you can see that every day in our team. We have a philosophy that, that maintained year after year and, and we talk about the foundation of our program being find a way to get it done. And when we talk about finding a way to get it done, we say, boy, we're going to compete in our preparation. And we feel like if we can get guys who are going to practice their tails off and end up studying on and off the field and know the opponent, boy, the right things happen. If they practice with purpose and practice with intent, they get better as they have. They've been working hard now for two and a half weeks. We've been hitting each other, and here's the cliche, we're, we're hitting each other too long and it's time to get to somebody else where we can compete against, and, and um, it'll be really neat to find out who we are and what we have. <laughs> Opening at home on a Friday night, it's a month to the day of when we reported, and then we get to play against a, a very quality conference opponent right out the gate. What an opportunity for an environment, what an opportunity to figure out where you stand, what an opportunity to figure out where you are as a program.